Welcome back YouTube Pipe Smokers. Mutton Chop Piper here. Well, this video is entitled, I lost my mouse, so I have to open a 10 year old tin of tobacco. So let me explain. Um, earlier today I was doing some work on my computer and for some reason my mouse decided that it didn't work, want to work anymore. You know, so I was moving it around and, and it didn't want to work. So I replaced the batteries thinking, well, it's probably the batteries are bad. Nope, it didn't. So I knew that somewhere around the house I had put the original mouse that came with it because I had replaced that mouse with a one that was an infrared mouse, uh, a wireless mouse. So I started hunting around. I couldn't find it. Well, I opened one drawer that I hadn't opened in years started digging because, hey, I figured, you know, it's been years since I've replaced the mouse. So I started digging. Well, lo and behold, I found a couple of old pipes. I found a bag of, um, I think, some pipe cleaners and this. This is a tin of GL Peace Classic Collection Stratford Virginia Perique Blend. Give you a little bit closer look at it. And on the bottom, it says 025506. So I had put this in that drawer in 2006 and totally forgot about it. And I want to show you something else. It's still, still sealed. So I have no idea what this blend tastes like. I'll read what it says on the back here. Stratford is an enticing blend of delicately sweet brights and rich, ripe red Virginia tobaccos, seasoned with just the right amount of fine Louisiana Perique. The wonderfully nuanced interplay of sugar and spice is sure to delight the lover of this, ti this time honored combination. So, uh, the reason I'm doing this video is, is, I mean, it's a 10 year old tin of tobacco. I figured you guys would want to check it out at least and see, see what it looks like, see what it feels like, see what it smells like and see what it smokes like. I'm going to use my weeb radiator pipe to smoke some of it. So without further ado, let's get started. You ready? Here we go. Here we go. Three, two, one there it is it's open okay first of all once you take a look at it it's kind of a dark looking tobacco i don't know if that's because of the age it probably is i don't know if you can see that or not i don't know if the camera is going in and out or not let's see let's feel it Good tin. It's a. Uh, it's not too wet. It's not too dry. It's it's perfect. Now let me give a sniff. Ooh, man. Man, that smells really really good. Okay, I can't wait anymore. I'm gonna have to load up and and try it. So here we go. see how my draw is good all right here we go
All right, done. Now let's see, see what. Well, I can taste the age. It's fruity. Got a fruit note to it. It's fruity, but it's it's musty, you know, that that aged smell and, and taste, that aged, musty. Some sweetness in the background. Yeah, it's got that aged, fruity taste, and it's sweet. And now I can start to feel the peppery perique on my tongue. very good it's very delicious very satisfying it's uh, I can see why aging in tobacco uh, those does so much for it um, but it has a, a aged musty kind of taste uh, it's fruity um, plum um, a little bit of plum a little bit of uh, apricot maybe uh, and it's sweet. Now, not overly sweet, but it's sweet enough. Uh, but man, it's, is it good. I'm going to have to order some, uh, just a regular can of Stratford to see, to compare the two. So there you go. I just thought you might be interested in seeing a 10 year old tin of tobacco opened and smoked. Until my next video, I want to wish you and your family happy piping.